Here we go. Let's go. All right, it's working. Got the Raspberry Pi camera working. Now this thing will bug out eventually and give this kind of string error. But it's pretty cool. This thing is doing an inference really quickly. I mean, like six milliseconds. Okay. So then eventually it does give this um, bites too long error down at the bottom. But it's pretty cool. This is the uh, Raspberry Pi Cam, uh, Raz Pi Cam example here. So it works in the 32-bit operating system. I'm using version 1.7.4 of the Raspberry Pi Imager, and then I'm going to download this operating system, Raspberry Pi, 32-bit desktop. Previously, I was able to run all of the Google Coral examples except for two. They were the pipelined classification, because at the time I didn't have two corals, but now I do. And the other one was this one right here, the image recognition with video. And I think this was an operating system error. So I'm going to try this with a different operating system. We'll see how it goes. To run the Raspberry Pi Cam, Raspi Cam, go to this link here, and then follow the instructions. You just copy line by line into the terminal, and... Uh, should work. This is the Python program. Here is the classify example. It's working. Okay. Here we go. It thinks this is a this marker is a syringe most of the time. Pretty neat here. It really updates quickly. It's amazing um, how quickly it updates in the terminal. So this one uh, was installed GStreamer. This is GStreamer. This was installed with Raspberry Pi Cam and a bunch of others. And uh, this is the program and uh, pretty cool. I was able to get the GStreamer and Raspberry Cam to work with the single coral in the 32-bit operating system. I actually went back and was able to get the GStreamer to work in the 64-bit operating system as well, so that's good. But I wasn't able to get the Raspberry Cam to work in the 64-bit uh, operating system. Up next, I'm going to try two of these. Here's the setup. Raspberry Pi 4B, 4 gigabytes of memory. We have two corals set up, each on the... Each has its own USB 3 port. I might try the USB 2 later on this side and see how it compares in regard to performance. And then, I already did this, but in case you haven't done this, get started with the USB here, do the install, and then the example comes with it. So it's this Pi Coral example here in the examples folder. And we're going to try this pipelining example. And that is, you go here, coral.ai forward slash examples here, and then click on this Python one that takes you here to GitHub. A couple quick notes. I'm installing the standard version, not the max version. And then I'm running the example with the two accelerators on the 64-bit uh, Raspbian desktop operating system. Well, that's annoying. Not enough edge TPUs detected. Expected two, detected one. Well, definitely have two plugged in. I unplugged them and plugged them back in and then got the same error again. I'm only seeing one when I do LS USB here. Otherwise, I'm just copying this code here to the terminal. I'm going to try to I'm going to I'm going to try to reboot the computer and see if it detects them. Otherwise, I'm going to have to try a couple other things. What I had to do was unplug 
I was getting an error that the second accelerator was not detected. So I unplugged the first one, which had the uh, runtime installed, and then installed the runtime on the second, plugged them both on, and gave it a shot. Unfortunately, I, well, the good news is I got further. But unfortunately, I had some errors here. Some interesting results here. But first, uh, yeah, make sure you copy each of these five lines line by line and hit enter um, individually. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, I got lazy after the first try here and like entered it all at once. It didn't work. Uh, it thought it was toilet paper and gave me some errors. So um, yeah, line by line, enter it. And then you get McCaw. It has 99%, over 99% confidence that it's a McCaw. It's interesting also um, the time over five iterations, 51 milliseconds. Now compare that to the previous example uh, where we just had one instead of two of these. And uh, this is from the previous video. Now the, uh, accu the uh, confidence was only 75%. And it was a bit quicker. Now, uh, one question I have is uh, the, the speed here. One question I have, this speed here, this is with the one coral. Um, how does that compare? So this is five iterations. So I guess around 10 milliseconds per iteration. That's with the two corals. So the speed, it's actually um, slower per iteration, but it's more confident that it's a macaw. Well, thank you for watching, and I hope you learned something, and happy experimenting with AI and the Raspberry Pi.